Hello peers welcome back to my channel in this series of lecture in the first part i have shown how to composite bands of landsat images using three alternative methods and also i have shown how to clip raster using five alternative methods and how to improve the spatial resolution of landsat images from 30 meter to 15 meter using pan sharpen tool now today i will discuss how to extract specific river or denis from landsat image or how to extract a specific class from landsat image and using the unsupervised classification so here my last work i have increased the spatial resolution from 30 meter to 15 meter here you can find cell size 15 meter into 15 meter of landsat at image you should understand carefully the signature of this image just uncheck it see no need this one so it's better to remove it so here you can find this area this signature that's when this is a forest area this z color shown here this is a agriculture area and here this is river this is a water body of river and this area that's when this is river bed sandbar here zoom to layer so here you can find the classification tool or if not find you can find here ms classification just right click here and select ms classification now see this tool ms classification it is selected my clip create pen sharpen raster so we can rename it it will be better go to properties general rename landsat 8 15 meter apply and okay now see here it is selected go to this classification tab here the iso cluster and supervised classification and maximum likelihood method click it now it is selected automatically landsat 8 15 meter image number of classes depend upon your purpose my target is to extract this genes or river body from this image so i will classify it into four now your output classifier raster you can change your path d at the landsat then coach bihar then basic remote sensing i'm creating a new folder here unsupervised okay double click give a name unsupervised class extension should be dot tif tif and save it now you should read it carefully before doing this go to this tool help here you can find the methodology of iso cluster and supervised classification you can find here the methodology here various option that's been input cluster band that's been your landsat image number of class it is depend upon you so you should read carefully this theory before doing this unsupervised class now just click okay it will take some time to process this classification if you give the more class then it will take the more time okay just finish now see here four class now you should identify the class number first one see this one this one water body number one this one water body click here just click here and take this effect tool here now here the effect tool and click it just click it sweep tool this one now see sweep it this area this signature that's in vegetation vegetation cover so this color shows number 3 that's in vegetation cover 
this color shows reverberate or bell length or uh, this color shows uh, cultivable length if you classify it in, in many class then it shows the band land it shows the other class like fellow land in this case my target only extract this river body and this river weight so it is enough for me now declassify it here the special analysis tool you can find here the declassify tool click it here the declass click it again and click the classify double click it now my unsupervised class input raster my unsupervised class it should be value old value one two three four and new value one two three four it's okay now just change the path here unsupervised click class this is a class and just type here g class you always give the proper name then you can find it easily after a long time now click ok now it reclassified it very easily now here you can find the conversation tool I have the conversation tool click it so click form raster form raster to polygon double click it now your input raster that's been declassify unsupervised class field value change the path the class unsupervised polygon no need to keep now extension because it is a shape file it automatically detect dot shsp now click ok okay now so here my river river body so now we can convert it easily or we can extract this river body easily so uncheck all now go to this catalog button here here my folder d lancet coach bihar here the basic remote sensing i am creating one new folder here river okay now select here and again go to the new but new and here the shape file so i am creating a polygon new shape file here river jol dhaka your cotton system go to edit button and choose your cotton system click ok and click ok go to this reclassify image click it here this is my jol dhaka river so here the select tool click it select features and select this one take a copy ctrl c now go to this editor toolbox start edit river jol dhaka now click ok uncheck it and ctrl v you targeted choose layer to create features river jol dhaka and click ok now see this is my river jol dhaka check it at the river jol dhaka now my next target is to extract this river weight or any class so go to this the class unsupervised polygon go to this properties here here the definition query select query builder here now select git code select this get unique value here here one two three four value that's been four so is equal to four and click ok now apply and ok now we can find here only differ so right click and here the data and export data export data that's been selected export data selected features so change the path for the d here the landscape coach vr basic remote sensing river now it is river bed river bed save it and click ok you can't create a new layer table with this command of editor workplace ok 
that's when here the your editor toolbox is open so you should save edit and stop edit now we can do it go to data and export data and if i bet save it click ok yes now uncheck it you can find only this class now click the start editing button start editing at the river bed select this river bed and click ok now select this and delete again select this and delete select this delete Carefully select other class and delete it. Reverse Joltaka, this one this is the main reverse Joltaka. Just select and delete from your keyboard. Just press delete button. Nothing else. Very easy task was time taking. This is the plain area. January month image. That's why it shows only Tholoic. In this way you can extract any class like sometime you need one class only like agriculture or sometime only urban area only build up area you can show easily if we use the supervised class or machine learning methods then your classifier will be more better But you should know the all the methods now I am skipping this video this is boring task so I have deleted all the unnecessary polygon you should delete it carefully I just delete roughly because it is for demonstration purpose now next task go to this geo processing tool here and go to dissolve and input features that's mean reverberate and I want to dissolve according to git code, select this git code, output feature class, change it the path, D, Lancet, Coach Bihar, basic remote sensing, river, river pit, Jol Dhaka, save it and click ok. Now it make one polygon just select it now see all are now composed into one so here the river and river bed uncheck it this my river bed so now go to this open empty table now see here only one git code that's in four okay open active table clear selected Uncheck it, it. Select this one. Change the color. Add blue color for river. Or you can give another color like deep blue. This one. This is for sandbar. Here. You can see. You can use this method in your channel migration study channel evolution channel shifting so today up to here next day i'll show the rest of part how to classify image using supervised classification using machine learning method like support vector machine random forest happy learning see you in the next tutorial very soon